Hey, what's up? Now, this is pretty much my add-on for my last video. See, I was, obviously I was at work and I was on break, so I didn't really have that much time to play with, which pretty much made me forget other people that I actually want to promote as well. Now, again, this is a me promoting other channels here on YouTube, which the theme is wrestling, you know, like the entertainment wrestling of things. Now, the person, you know, think of it as an add-on, but anyway, if you're a tech head, you're into technologies, or you want something that dabbles in the world of um, working out, or, you know, like how to set up your own home gym, what, you know, the reviews on certain criteria, and even a little dabble of video games, and a little bit of, um, like, uh, theories, <laughs> definitely check out Stevie Richards. Now, if that name sounds familiar, that means you're pretty much familiar with him when he was wrestling for ECW. He was part of the flock, and then he became more popular when he became the Blue War, the leader of the Blue World Order, BWO, which was a parody of NWO. Then, you know, obviously they went to WWE or WWF, you know, at the time frame, where he was still there, but he did other things such as um, right to censor, you know. Anyway, I'm giving way too much. I mean, Stevie Richard, he's, yeah, he does have his own channel. And like I said, if you're a tech head, because he, he is as well, he's all about, you know, promoting tech from different companies, um, what their pros and what their cons. And he actually tests these things out. It's not like he just get these things. And, you know, pretty much say all the good things that companies would like to, um, you know, hear. And, you know, obviously be like, oh, don't forget to mention this or mention that. You know, pretty much like uh, shilling or shelling. But, no, he don't do that. He just give a straight up honest review. He look at it in the point of view of as a consumer would because he himself is a consumer. So he would obviously, these items that he get, he even thinks about, would this stuff be something he would use day to day? Um, who it would be recommended for? You know, and he'll be honest. If some of the stuff is not for him, it's not for him. But yeah, and like I said, he does other things on his channel. Like um, like I said, if you a little bit of workout, cause he's also a um, a physical trainer. You know, he trains people working out, like a workout trainer. Um, he does his own. Uh, he'll play a little bit of video game. He don't really have video games on his channel but he do talk about them on his channel so yeah like I said I'm just repeating myself at this point check out Stevie Richards you know obviously everything I'm gonna mention gonna be in the description box now the next person I completely can't believe I forgot to mention him the whole time I was talking about Bullet Club and Kenny Omega and Gorillas of Destiny definitely check out Cody or, you know, you guys may know him as Cody Rhodes, or Cody Runnels, or Stardust, whatever. He, to me, he's the American Nightmare. And, yes, he do have his own YouTube channel. It's kind of like The Rock YouTube channel, where it's like, you can tell they're, like, definitely good, high-quality team people behind, you know, the camera that's working with him on his YouTube channel. Now, it doesn't mean it's a bad thing. It's basically his channel evolved around, you know, his mentality, like the behind the scenes stuff of this event that's coming up pretty soon known as All In. And he's giving like his insight, he promoting other matches, he giving you um, more info about these wrestlers that's going to be a part of the um, wrestling pay-per-view event. Which, by the way, Cody, congratulations. I mean, you are doing everything that... I can pretty much say your father would be proud of you of doing, and not just your father, but everybody else in your family, like, you know, Gold Dust, you know, Dustin Reynolds, and everybody. I mean, obviously, I'm just a, I'm not somebody from the inside, so I won't really know, but I kind of have that feeling that you're doing something outside the box, and I'm actually proud, you know, that you're doing these things, but yeah, he definitely has his own YouTube channel, and I highly recommend it if you're ever into the mindset of somebody that's promoting of an event or somebody that's being the boss of an event um you know if you want to do something like that yourself like become a wrestling promoter yourself or whatever see what he goes through and some of the stuff that he talk about because you got taken you know 
mind, you know, maybe these are the bumps and hurdles that you might go through. But other than that, highly recommended. Yeah, Cody. That is his YouTube channel name. Now, I forgot to add, I'm going to try to slide this in real quick, but I forgot to mention DDP Yoga. Now, of course you guys know who Diamond Dallas Page is, if you were a fan of um, WCW days, and he did a little TNA stuff. Well, he's currently a Hall of Famer from WWE, and he created this program. It's more in the realms of exercising, getting in shape, but also having a new mentality, something uplifting. And he also has a YouTube channel, of course, called DDP Yoga. Or just look for Diamond Dallas Page or whatever. They are going to be synonymous to his main channel. And obviously, you know, I'll throw the link in the below. But yeah. Thought I'd throw this in there before I get to the editing, so, um, back to the clip. <laughs> Another person I forgot to mention, well, I feel like he has a lot of subscribers anyway, but it's like, I feel, well, anyway, it's Grim. Well, we all probably know his real name is Dave. He has a, a multitude of channels. Like, there's his main one where it's pretty much kind of like a family blog entertainment style type ordeal. And then there's the GTS, where it's under the YouTube channel Silly Super Pop. What GTS is, is pretty much a, re a scripted wrestling parody of anything that's popular going on in wrestling. Most likely from WWE, but... It's like the characters, these people that um, portraying these characters, some of them are original, some of the wrestling styles or whatever, but the drama is actually more, I don't know, you can sort of feel it a little bit better, you know what I mean, even though some of it is extremely exaggerated, but the entertainment value, that's where it counts. Now, the reason why I'm promoting his channel is because obviously we all know how YouTube been, and they've been pretty much um, giving him from what it sounds like the shaft because of the content that he create on his silly super pop channel and like I said if you're looking for like a I wouldn't say it's a backyard wrestling it's more like a, um, a warehouse wrestling where it has some fun and entertainment and you can see who who but the entertainment value is there the characters are I mean Hollywood hooligan is a phenomenal good wrestler and I don't want to mention every other wrestler at this point because I'd rather you guys check it out so yeah um, like I said he has other plethora of channels even his own wife has her channel which is Doll Cat's World but I don't know if she's putting anything up, but like I said this is based on wrestling theme so um, definitely check out um, Silly Super Pop because that's more involved in wrestling you can watch his main channel because every now and then the stuff that he put on gts falls into his main channel stuff but yeah there you go now um in de like i said check him out as well um let's see there, obviously i already mentioned it the rock now the rock yes he has his own youtube channel yes probably not a surprise to everybody Yes, it seems more like it's, um, I wouldn't say manufactured, but he has a team of people behind the camera working with him with the editing and everything to do his video. And it, a lot of people look at it like it's a controversial thing because he's not, he's a big star, yes, but he's not like a superstar or whatever. And I feel like, you know, anybody can pretty much make a channel if they want to. The styling and everything is all different, but... There is entertainment value on his channel, so definitely check out The Rock channel, you know, Dwayne Johnson. And, you know, see if you enjoy it or not. It's all up to you. I'm not going to force your hand to it, but highly recommend it. Also, if you follow, I guess they are going by the name Impact Wrestling right now. There's a female wrestler. It's like Bunny, that's her name. And she has her own YouTube channel as well. Yes, a female wrestler has her own YouTube channel. And it's more like a vlog style, kind of like Girls of Destiny, but it's a lot different. It's more interactive. She's more like, you can tell she's being herself as a person, conveying and talking to you. And it's obviously really good. It's very well done. 
she very good friends with Rose. Like I said, if you're familiar with TNA, you know, Total Nonstop Action, um, they went through a lot of different names. But right now, I believe they're currently going by Impact Wrestling. But, yeah, that company, that's a whole different video. But if you're familiar with who Bunny is and you're familiar with Rosemary, definitely check out her channel. You know, I'll put the link to the description as well. Um, now I'm at the point where I'm really trying to remember. You know what? It's late. So how about this? Like I said in the beginning, well, not even the beginning. If you want, you can also um, promote the chan um, any channel that involved with the theme of wrestling. Put them down in the comment section. And definitely have a link because I'll also check them out. And this way you're also um, promoting other people's channel as well. So it's be like a big old union. And, you know, you need a lot of that, you know, where it's like, if you feel like there's people who need more notoriety, definitely put it down. Uh, I'll check it out, and who knows, maybe I'll even make another video promoting their channels as well. But it'll be a good introduction to promote their channel to other people. So, highly recommend you guys doing that as well. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and until then, later.